Today, we're diving into the world of user manuals. Whether you're a product developer, a tech enthusiast, or someone who's been tasked with creating a user manual, this video is for you. We'll be showing you how to leverage ChatGPT to craft clear, comprehensive, and user-friendly manuals. Let's get started. First, let's plan the structure of our user manual. A well-organized manual typically includes sections like, let me show you right here, there's the introduction, safety information, setup instructions, operating instructions, maintenance and care, troubleshooting, facts, and warranty information right here. Now, start by listing the main sections your manual needs, which is the one I'm currently doing right now, the one I just did. Then, for example, if you're creating a user manual for a new kitchen appliance, for instance, that I'll be doing in my demonstration, your sections might look like this. Here we go. This is the one I listed once more. So having a clear outline will help you and ChatGPT right here stay organized and ensure you cover all necessary information. And in addition to that, we'll need to make sure that ChatGPT will stay informed with the outline that we just created. So let me put a prompt right here. So here's what I said. ChatGPT, remember this outline for you to help me craft a user manual. Then let's hit send. See, as you can see, ChatGPT has got it notified. Now, let's proceed to the next step. Now, let's see how ChatGPT right here can assist us in creating these sections right over here. Now, we'll begin by generating content for the introduction section. Here we go, this one. So here's the prompt we'll be using. Let's say, ChatGPT, Help me write down an introduction for a user manual for a new kitchen appliance called the, let's say I came up with Quick Cook Pro right here. It should be briefly described the product and its main features. So let's see how ChatGPT would process with based on what I put here in my input. As you can see right now, it's currently processing with the introduction. ChatGPT has provided a comprehensive introduction. It's detailed and covers the essential points about the Quick Cook Pro that I asked. Now, let's see how we can further generate with the following sections after the introduction. Right here, let's say starting with safety information. So let's say ChatGPT list safety precautions for using the Quick Cook Pro. Now, let's see how ChatGPT would generate with this. As you see right here, ChatGPT quickly generates a list of safety precautions, such as supervision, avoid water contact, proper assembly, steam release, pressure safety, and so on and so forth while it's currently processing from ChatGPT right here. So it's always a good idea to review and edit these suggestions to make sure they align perfectly with your product specifications and safety standards. Now for the setup instructions. We'll ask ChatGPT right here to give us a clear and step-by-step -step guide. Here's the prompt we'll use right here in the input. ChatGPT, provide step-by-step -step setup instructions for the Quick Cook Pro. Now, let's see how this goes. So as always with this, ChatGPT delivers detailed setup instructions, making sure each step is easy to follow. It's essential that these instructions are clear to prevent any user frustration. If ever needed, you can also adjust the language to match the tone of your manual and include any additional details specific to your product. Next, let's get content for the operating instruction section. Here's how we'll prompt ChatGPT right here. So let's say 
ChatGPT explain how to use the Quick Cook Pro, including its different modes and settings. So, there we go, once again. There we go. It might take a while, so as you'll see right here, ChatGPT provides a thorough explanation of how to use the appliance, covering various modes and settings. This ensures that users can fully utilize the product's features. Before we proceed, if you find this video helpful so far, please consider subscribing to help YouTube algorithm show my video to other ChatGPT nerds like us. Once you've generated content for all sections, just in case, it's time to refine and organize it. Review the generated text and make any necessary adjustments. So here's the prompt right here that I'll be using for this instance. Let's say, ChatGPT, simplify the following instructions for better clarity. But which one will you choose for ChatGPT to adjust for better clarity? So let's say you have one of the paragraphs or instructions that are a bit too complicated for the users to understand. So how about we'll go with this one just in case. Let's see, assemble the appliance. You can either right click, copy or CTRL plus C, then paste it right here to be included in the prompt, or you can just highlight it and click reply right here. Easy. Now, let's hit enter and we'll see how ChatGPT would respond based on this. So here we go, as you'll see. So pay attention to clarity and consistency. Using prompts like this can help you refine the content to ensure it's user-friendly. Always read through the output to make sure it fits the context and tone of your manual. Also, if you need to ensure the consistency of terminology throughout the manual, you can use a prompt here like Right here, ChatGPT, can you help me create a glossary of technical terms for the Quick Cook Pro user manual? So let's see how ChatGPT would respond with this. And with this, it helps you create a glossary or ensure that terms are used consistently, ensuring that these terms that is currently processing based on what ChatGPT had generated are explained and instructions are easy to follow. Cool, right? Before you publish, consider these final tips. So first, let's proofread the document to catch any typos or grammatical errors. Here's a prompt you can use to ask ChatGPT for assistance. Here we go. So let's say, please proofread the following user manual for typos and grammatical errors. If you want, you could do the entire thing that ChatGPT had generated, or you can select the following sections or paragraphs that is. So without getting any errors or taking too much time, let's go with a section perhaps. So how about this one? Let's see if this has any grammatical errors or typos, for instance. So here we go. Let's hit send. So as you'll see, ChatGPT will review the text and suggest corrections, ensuring your manual is polished and professional. Now, the next thing we're going to do, it's crucial to get feedback from a few users to ensure the manual is clear and helpful. You could use ChatGPT right here to simulate user feedback. So what I'm going to ask here is, let's see, assume you are a user of this application. What part of this user manual might be confusing or need more detail? So why not the entire thing this time without any highlighted sections or text paragraph? So let's see how it goes. So with this prompt, 
it really helps identify potential areas where users might struggle, allowing you to make necessary adjustments. As you can see right here, this is the following feedback that ChatGPT is currently generating and suggesting for improvements for the manual itself. See, really impressive so far. Just give ChatGPT more time. There we go. After incorporating all the feedback and design improvements, your user manual might be ready for publishing. So here's an example of how you might conclude your process with ChatGPT right here. So let's say, please review the final version of this user manual and confirm if it is ready for publication. So here we go. Let's hit enter once more. As you'll see right here, ChatGPT will give a final review and the final version itself when it's put together, ensuring everything is in place. Once you're satisfied, you can publish your user manual with confidence. So, and there you have it. With ChatGPT right here, creating a user manual is a breeze. You can generate detailed, content quickly and easily, allowing you to focus on refining and perfecting your manual.